Hello guys, Igor here doing one more app sumo review. Today analyzing Knorish, a tool that claims to quickly create and sell online course, webinars, and memberships right from your site. Knorish lets you create and sell course, webinars, and memberships from your website and mobile apps, no coding required. It's an alternative to Kajabi and Teachable. So it's another online course tool that one is established. They are here since 2017. I think it's an Indian platform and they already have good reviews worldwide. And they have pretty different interesting features like Zoom and the white label course website and mobile apps. So it's not like uh, they already raised funds and they have many employees. So if you need an e-learning tool, it could be the one to go. As you can see here, they have integrations with Zapier, YouTube, Zoom, Facebook Pixel, MailChimp, FreshTask, Vimeo, Google Ads. So it's a well-established tool. And take a look that depending on your tier, on the tier, you're going to get different plans. So if you get tier one, you get startup, tier two pro plan and tier three, the power plan, which has more features. As you can see here, license tier one, you get one authors and an editor. So uh, one um, a teacher author. And if you get the tier two, then you get white label and five authors. So it's a tool to get at least the tier two with the pro plan but if you get the tier three you're gonna get their power plan with 50 authors i'm gonna show you the difference between the planes because this one is important for that too and here is the courage website and you can see here on their plans that the power plan has different features here they get white label android and ios app daily payout one extra concurrent live session fully white label website single sign on so sso and all the knowledge funnel builder, te builder templates so you get more features if you get the tier three this one try to get tier two and if you can get the tier three because then you get all the features i'm going to show you the tool as you can see here everything is on the left you have a tutorial here that they will you know drive you with the things you need to do to create your course so the first thing they say you to do is to create your first course so clicking here you can see that we have uh, the course tab where you create a new course you can create bundles, create live sessions. So you will use uh, Zoom for those live sessions. You can divide the course by categories, like, uh, you know, by different kind of topics. And on the settings, you can see here that you can, on your course library, change the name. Uh, everything can be multi-language because you can change everything uh on the on, uh, like on the student side as i can see by now and you can change the card design you can also change the meta descriptions and meta keywords okay and to create a course you click here to create a new course and then you enter the course name and click on create and here you can add section or add live section okay you can also install a team or your school as a whole but let's see how how we do how we create the course first so you have two options live section for the zoom integration okay so you get an active zoom integration with the tool but on, uh, on the app zoom plan to use the live sessions you need to pay 22 dollars per month okay so come here to add section so section and here you're gonna add uh chapters and the different chapters are video where you can 
embed the video from because you can upload but on Apple plan you can't you don't have video hosting so you need to embed the video okay and then embed the video you can use YouTube Vimeo Prezi Google Docs Google Sheets Google Slides uh Google Form and I think Vadu will uh work as well and then Aluga so you can use previous video hosting apps modules to embed the video here you can add a PDF file to create your chapters. You can add a quiz. Okay. You can add objective questions with options. Okay. And also subjective questions on your quiz. You can also add a live event with the Zoom integration. And you can create a page inside your course as a chapter of your course okay like that here's a preview and you can use the, the block features to add you know things to your page this feature is pretty cool because you know you can you don't need to add plain text you can you know uh, customize a page to be more interactive to, um, to your students and it will be you know beautiful to present text items and pretty easy as well i really like that that feature to create a page inside your course to uh, be one of the lessons that you will show to your students really like that feature i think you can we can preview the the page here i'm gonna show you this is a pretty unique feature on knorsh as you can see here your students will learn not only with plain text but with a whole you know uh, website experience page experience that's new that's a thing that i only saw on knorish before you publish your course you can add the image of your course you can select between the level you can add the course language as you can see here the language that they have yeah they don't have um all the language so it's english and pretty much the indian language okay so it can be an issue for some people you add the price okay or indian price or the us price so they don't have uh, yet you know a whole multi-language site as you can see it's english or indian you can select if it's a feature course if it's visible uh, to public or not and you can also enable a certificate download chat limit the number of uh, sales and you can also after people buy they will be just like redirect to your course and to create your website your whole school you can select one of the website themes that that Knorsh has you know there's a team for different kind of schools as you can see here so let's check out some of their teams teams that you can use uh, to create your own school inside Knorsh. here's one of those teams you can see that you get a whole page with about uh, the course you can also use Knorsh to create blog posts. So Knorsh has a blog post built-in feature. If you want to install that team, just click here to install that one. This one seems cool as well. Let's take a look at it. This one is pretty nice. So that's another template for your course. So it's pretty easy to start. You just select a template and then you change it. Okay, you can blog. If you want to select that one, click here on install, and then that will be the template of your website. Okay, here's my school. If I want to edit the main page, I just click here to edit my school, and then I will go direct, direct it to their page builder. So clicking here, I can change everything on the school. You can also add the HTML, just clicking here. If you know how to use it, you can add eight TML codes. You can change here. 
directly the code. It's like Elementor, you can change what you have here and you can also add blocks. Okay, just drag and drop the block and then you will, will create your landing page or even uh, change your home page. If you want to add new users, just go here. You can add users clicking here and you can also assign a course to your student from that uh, tab. You can also personalize your domain, just fully uh, white label your course without any branding. So you're going to use Cloudflare custom domain with SSL. As payment gateways, they have PayPal, Stripe, RazorPay, and PayTM by now. As marketing tools, you can add Facebook Pixel, Google Tag Manager, Google Analytics, and MailChimp Marketing Email Integration, adding the MailChimp API here. As an SC CMS integration, they have Freshdesk. Also, you can use Zapier. And also you can have an SSO if you get the tier three. Also, they provide your API. As you can see here, you can build your app inside the tool. You can change the app settings on Android, the app settings on Apple, and also you can build the app home screen. Of course, I would need a page plan for that, but I'm gonna show you that you can uh, on on Knorr, customize your app to uh, then install, uh, publish on Apple Store or Android. On Analytics, you can see your total course, total users, total assessment, and total certificated issued. They have also a funeral builder inside the tool, and you can create a landing page funnel or a webinar funnel. Let's select the webinar funnel. I would need to upgrade my plan to see that. So let's see that uh, landing page funnel. So here you name the funnel, then you select a course. I would need to publish my course for that, but you just name your funnel and then you will choose a landing page team for the course, a page URL. Then they say to promote your page, integrate the market tool and launch ad. So the idea here, you create a funnel inside Knorsh and then you will launch ad to get, you know, more students. So you have uh, your own funnel builder inside the tool. The idea here is that you have the, the whole uh, package to create online course without the need to use external tools. Here are the blog settings. You can change the blog names, add meta titles, meta descriptions, meta keywords, a uh, number of posts to be displayed um, on blog homepage. And clicking here, you make your blog live. And you can create, like in any blog, different categories uh, to your blog posts. If you want to create a blog post, just go to blog post inside website builder and click here to create a new blog post and then you enter the name of your blog post this look the title of seo description you have all the seo features here you can add a, he a custom header code to each blog post and also a footer for instance if you want to add uh, a live chat specific live chat on a blog post you can do that with the, those specific features you can pick a template and then select where you people will see your blog posts. Then you select the image of your uh, blog posts, uh, the featured image, and you can select if it will be a featured blog post or, or not. And here's the builder where you're gonna add, uh, you're gonna edit your blog posts. So you can just keep adding blocks and typing here, changing, you know, making it bold, just adding headers, like any, you know, blog. I think it's cool that they have the, those blocks that it make 
easier for you to make your blog post shine with different pictures, etc. So as you can see here, you have a whole blog inside the tool. That's Knorsch. I, I think this tool is pretty solid and it also has a lot of features. It can be a tool to go if you need uh, an e-learning platform that will give you all the features you need to shine as in the e-learning marketing that is growing every day. So I hope you like Knorsch. If you like any, anyone to know more about the, the deal, just click on the link below. Thank you so much.